they didn't call real world a reality show. Reality TV became a thing after Survivor. What? I do that when I know I'm no, right. real world was a reality show. They just didn't call it that. But that would be the yes, first reality yes, show. Yes, correct. Yeah. They literally called yeah. it real world. Right. As but, a reality. but they didn't yeah. call it. <laughs> oh, we got to fire both these guys, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you ever met this guy? Oh, I'm the dumb one. You can't argue there's something about me. You have no idea what you're saying. Gang, gang. Buzz, buzz. Soul. All right, look, dude. What? You guys, we got some... Dude. <laughs> you might be like, what's with the background? I, I I don't recognize it. We got something a little spicy coming in. We're not announcing it yet, but you'll you'll see in the next two weeks, dude. I mean, we're not even close to done, but no, it's, no, no, it's no, looking we're tasty. Not. We're not, but we got, we got this going on. And then next week, Eric's not going to be here. And then the next week... Shooting a movie. Forget it. <laughs> Bam, next, bam, week, bam. next week, forget it, dude. In two weeks, we got something. You're going to want to set your calendars, dude. I don't know what, what date that is, but... Uh, first week of November, first I week think. Of 25th. November. All right, look, Nick. Either way, you know, early November. Like, second. Nick, second. November okay, 2nd. November 2nd. Nick, we got to talk, Nick. Yes. But yeah. Um, <laughs> November 2nd. It's going We got something that we are unveiling, and, uh, and that's it. Speaking of unveiling, I will be in Savannah, Georgia on Saturday. And Raleigh uh, on uh, Friday, the day before that, and then I'm going to be in Boston. Oof. I got uh, the second show at the Wang. Uh, some tickets left, and uh, and that's what's up. Crystalia.com. Speaking of unveiling, I'm gay. Oh. That, no, I'm not. Well, I thought we were going to wait two weeks. Oh, God. That was the that. big announcement. Yeah. God damn fuck. it. Now we're fucked. God damn it. I had the date wrong anyways. He was supposed to come out on the third, oh, not okay. the second. So, Boom. So there. Yeah. I don't know if that's a big I'm in Salt Lake City this week. Uh, Calgary <laughs> next week, Thursday, Friday. And then after that, I'm in San Antonio, Houston. Get you some. Uh, speaking of uh, unveiling, oh. Nick, you uh, you shaved the beard. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's what's different. Oh, I was Jeffrey like, Dahmer uh, Vaughn. But no, but I, thought, I was like, why does Nick seem... Like nicer friend. yeah <laughs> now he looks 41 i love it yeah not, he looks not. way younger yeah <laughs> i don't like it i think i have a soft jaw but <laughs> honestly honestly i like his jaw that's kind of what every guy thinks though yeah you know you gotta uh, 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 i don't mean every guy thinks you have a soft jaw i mean every guy thinks that they have a soft jaw did you just see me shrink? It's a new set. Yeah. All right. We're, going, we're working through the <laughs> wrinkles. Fucking All right. Some things pop off. I don't want to get too big. Too, too, too tall, that was weird. We had to get, I things popped off. Cheers this morning. You that was yeah, I know. <laughs> Did you guys my shit? You know what happens is. That looked like a goat. My, uh, There's a ghost in here. You know who that is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Uh, we gotta talk about finances, dude. Uh, dude. Oh no, man. Ooh, I may not make it. Ooh. And then the ghost doesn't show up, and we're like, "Where the fuck Wait, is this ghost?" But it'd be crazy. If there's like a nanny cam we don't know, and he's been, there's like a control board just yeah, nah. fucking with it, shutting down cameras. We're like, "It's a ghost." No. Uh, Nick, why'd you shave though? If you hated your yeah, why'd chin? you shave? Uh, so I went to uh, BravoCon this weekend. Oh, we gives that away the shirt. Yeah, everyone's well, so clean cut there though. Yeah. Yeah, you had to be. No, I bought this oh. off a staffer so I could get in wherever I wanted and skip the lines. And the third day, they caught me and kicked me out, so I shaved, changed, and went back. You got to be kidding me! No, I vlogged the whole thing. This yeah. guy's insane. <laughs> and, 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 okay, well, why did wait? Why did you go, go ahead? Go ahead. First of all, yeah, uh, I do a podcast right, on Below what, Deck. Okay, that's what I thought. And, well, you're and, balls deep in Bravo shows. Yeah, Winter House. Mm -hmm. uh, do you want to see me get kicked out? Does he physically harm you? No. Okay, let's see it. Yeah, fuck. I mean, <laughs> And what is it? Are you on a? Uh, what does are you on a GoPro here? Uh, I yeah, GoPro. I was I was just walking around with it because I had the staff shirt on. So oh, I thought it was like a new thing. They have a criminal cam now. <laughs> yeah. Hey, real quick, the guy with the <laughs> the the foo foo drink on the are his nails painted or? Oh, yeah, they are. I think it might be a larger woman. Yeah, you're at Bravo. Wait, no, on the right. On, on the, the right. right. Yeah. No, no, there's they, a oh, woman. It's not the guy's. No, hand. I'm not talking oh, about. That's hilarious. Oh, it's like an optical illusion. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. I'm not the talking about the handsome woman. I'm talking about the guy on the right. No, it's not his hand. That's not his hand holding the cup. Looks like it's his oh, hand. I see. That's okay, yeah. Dude, yeah. hit it from the TI herd. Uh, from, uh, who are you with? Uh, um, C C S E. C S E. Oh, the company is uh, the third party security company. C S E. Why are you wearing a Bravo shirt? Huh? Why are you wearing a shirt? Are you just making up C S E? Oh no, it's a the the mix. Can you turn that off? Yeah. I gotta take your name down. He's following you right now? Yeah. I don't have any. 
He asked me for ID. Wait, is this, is this all fake? Yeah. Is all that stuff fake? What? Yeah. <laughs> and this was just so you didn't have to wait in line, Nick? And to, yeah, I was doing a bunch of shenanigans. So you could meet your favorite cast members? I was taking people from back of the lines and ushering to the front of the lines. What group of ladies, ladies paid me 50 bucks? Wow. <laughs> Quite the hustle. Oh, that's Hey, and now he starts yelling for security. You just sprint off? But they didn't know who he was talking about. Because they had a shirt on. You look nervous there. I'm going to look at walking slow. They always say, walk, don't, don't run. Oh, wait, look sweating. at his, his forehead is sweaty sweating as hell. <laughs> <laughs> the way he's walking is nice, though. Yeah, he couldn't be Dahmer. Dahmer and and then I got out the, the door of the convention center, and I just sprinted. sprinted. Nice. And then you shaved. And then I went to outfit. Times Square, bought a shaver, shaved, went back. And you're in New York? Uh, yeah. And oh, you're all by yourself? Yeah. Hell. They don't fuck around with this. <laughs> yeah. You could be a terrorist. <laughs> wow. Um, yeah. Wow. Did you, did you wow. see any of your favorite cast members? Oh, yeah. Uh, Kate Chastain, Queen of the Sea, Captain yeah, Lee, Never Captain Jason, Never the whole crew. Yeah, my, my <laughs> two captains. Rachel watches Below Deck. It's oh, a, right. It's I've, a nightmare. I've heard about it, yeah. yeah. I used to work for show. Bravo, and we did a show, and yeah. I, had to, I had to binge watch like all whatever seasons of Real Housewives of Spokane, Real Housewives of Utah, all the shit. Well, how many do they have? It's so many. a lot now. So like many. 10? Yeah, there's, uh, there's even Real Housewives of Atlanta, Real Housewives of Orange County was the original. Nashville Real, now, right? Uh, Atlanta, Nashville, Dallas. New Jersey, Atlanta, Dallas. And, and now they have one called Spoken. Real Girlfriends of Paris. What? Yeah. In, uh, Paris, they're not even France. wise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're they're in Paris. They so, should have, wow. Oh, I used to love Don't Be Tardy. Wow. Yeah, there you Potomac, go. that was the one I had to binge watch, and it Potomac. was a doozy. Vanderpump is ridiculous. The original OC is fantastic. All those dudes that uh, one, dudes two, and, three, four, and five, the six, guys and girls at Vanderpump would come eight, to my nine, shows. Ten, eleven, yeah. Damn, they have twelve, and I don't count. But Vanderpump is in the family of housewives. Yeah, isn't that it's under the housewives umbrella? It Lisa was a housewife of one of them. Uh, right. All right, That's cool. Yeah, so those were all, they were all really cool to me, man. Yeah, I these are guys. subsidiary shows. Like, what are the other? Wow. I, I I did a show that uh, uh, that show with Andy Cohen and one of the Orange County girls on there, and she was white girl wasted. Yeah, well, my, I just mean, why grabbing not? me. My yeah, Andy Cohen, uh, that whatever his job is, the recap stuff that he does, impossible job. That's my uh, nightmare. That's the worst job I think you can there's, have. There's Are a worst you job. Kidding me? No, there's a worse job. I love and hip hop. Yeah, you, no. because you like. No, no, because I want to stir it up. Yeah. The fav- you don't even have to watch the shows. The mm. favorite thing is to watch mm. the wrap-up shows mm. when all the people are there. Yeah, yeah. And, the then, and you're just going like this, so why would you slap uh, t- yeah, Charlie? Yeah, yeah. And they're like, I didn't slap. You know, and you're just yeah, like, yeah, yeah. it seems like that's us go to the tape. But you're not, but, yeah, but it's not, but, you, but it's not something you're interested in. To He's me, interested. I would be like, what? He's interested. Andy Cohen's a producer. For me, it yeah, would for, be the fucking or for you nightmare either, job. I'd rather be crack whore. Yeah, I'd rather, load me up, dude. Yeah, I'd rather be like, I'd rather be like, <laughs> load me up, dude, me in the back of a Chevelle. Uh, I'd rather fucking. I'd rather be a Bukaki boy. For yeah, me. dude. Yeah. Let, let me take fucking okay. this is barbells up. to the no barbells to the face. <laughs> <laughs> but the, but that, Wait, does he want barbells to the face? <laughs> but Andy Cohen's easy compared to uh, Love and Hip Hop because there's always a fight. Love and Hip Hop's the toughest gig. So I'm saying. They're fighting on there. I don't know. I've never seen it. You don't remember? Ba- you don't. You ever seen Bad Girls Club? That's the oh one. right. You told me about that. And Bad that, Girls we, Club. We, we, we watched it on this on yeah. here. Love and hip hop autos. I love yeah. all that. I like Cardi B. Came love and hip hop. That's where she got her first pop. Really? Yeah. Oh, she was wow. a character. Yeah. This is crazy. Survivor started this all. That show, Survivor, the fir- the re- first like reality TV. Was thing. it Survivor? Yeah. No, was Survivor before? Remember the shows that like Love and Hip or uh, was it Flavor of Love and Rock of Love? Well, no. Survivor. The, the, the real first one is uh, Sharon. You know what's that? What Osborne's. Was the, the Osborne's. No, that that. No, no, no. Survivor was first. I don't no, know. Real World. I think Real, real World. world. Was oh, yeah. but, but Survivor was network and it popped it off. Yeah, yeah, but but it was but the real but Survivor was the first time you heard a reality show. No, Real World. Yeah, no, but it's they real, bro. I think you're right. They, I, I, me, I, yes. Yeah, they didn't call Real World a reality show. Reality TV became a thing after Survivor. What? I'll do that when I know I'm no, right. Real World was a reality show. They just didn't call it that, but that'd be the yes, first reality yes, show. Yes, correct. Yeah. They literally called yeah. it Real World, right? As but, a reality, but they didn't yeah. call it. <laughs> oh, we got fired both these guys, dude. <laughs> 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 they didn't, they didn't call it reality TV. 
Uh, yes, I was surprised. Yeah, these, wait, these two are feeling themselves yeah, these days. Yeah, dude, the new huh? set. They're like, yeah. you know what they did? They got here early, and they, they look at the set, and they go like this. Yeah. Stuff's going to be different. See what, happens, see what happens when you get a new yeah. office manager? Yeah, dude, now these guys are like, God. Oh. They're all going to come in. They're all going to be buff. Dude, Mark's going to be training them all. <laughs> They're all, fuck these guys. And then for yeah. some reason, we're going to be over there. Yeah. <laughs> we don't even realize it until yeah. a few shows Wait, in. What the hell? They're like, no, we just switched the cameras. Why, why am I looking up stuff on Google? <laughs> like, Google that shit. I'm, I'm, pulling, I'm pulling shit up. I pull yeah, up four yeah. or five things. And I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> Nick goes, can you give me a Diet Coke? And, yeah, right away. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, reality television emerged as a distinct genre in early 1990s with shows such as The Real World. In the 90s, and then the success of the series Survivor, American Idol, not really. Big oh, Brother. Are you kidding me? Survivor was Big the biggest thing on TV. Uh, no, but Survivor? American Idol is not a reality show. Yeah, okay. I see, what I see it. American Idol is a competition. You know what it's like, though? But you know that's what it's like, version though? of reality. Now, you know what it's like huh? when you say, when did social media start? Everyone thinks MySpace. Friendster was first. Friendster. But nobody fucking says Friendster because after MySpace, that's what kicked it off. This is what the Survivor did. Reality TV, or rea- no, the real what world. the real world did for Survivor. Yes. <laughs> real world was the French Friendster. Yes, that's what I'm saying. It was that's the first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So me and Chin are right. Yeah. So basically, yeah, you were most famous. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. You were wrong. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I, Let me do it. You were wrong, I remember Chris. back then, dude, and nobody was calling <laughs> fucking, nobody was calling real world reality TV. <laughs> when Chris is wrong, we're going to do like this. <laughs> Fuck off, man. <laughs> Fuck, I'm pissed already. <laughs> you, uh, Chris is wrong. <laughs> I enjoy real can we, world. Can we start doing the scoreboards and that mm-hmm. kind of stuff? I don't, I didn't like, I don't, I'm, reality TV makes me sad, bro. It does. It, it doesn't make Flavor me, of love? It no. all makes Rock me of sad. love was fantastic. It all <laughs> makes me sad, though. You walk out, dude, nobody turns off reality TV and goes, ah. They turn off reality TV and then they go about their day and then fucking a few hours in, they're like, Oh. Because you're watching dr- dr- and you don't drama. don't realize it. It fucking fucks you up. Well, that's dude. like that, that show Couples Therapy on Showtime. It was like Ooh, heavy, dude. Ooh, that My girl wanted to watch it. I'm like, yeah. if you want to fight, I'd rather fight in person than watch other people was fight. Scripted? It was real. I don't I think I think all reality TV is a little bit of a producer going. It is, yeah, like, it is, you know. Yeah. Like if like if, if Ultimate if, if, Fighter's if, not. If this was like reality TV, Nick would be like, you know, being like, hey, remember? You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, they'll yeah. do that stuff, but it's real stuff. Like Ultimate Fighter's not scripted in any fashion. Well, you guys are dealing with, but that's but fu- literally, you're tr- like, there's a fight. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. hold you on. You don't have the, to make a fight because yeah. you guys no, the, the, actually yeah. have to. The fight. fight's <laughs> the smallest footage on the show. The show is the guys it's in the house. It's the real fight. world, and you mix the real world with fighting. Mm. But the majority, like the drama in the show, is in the house. But they would like. Like, if I asked for food, it'd come, like, two days later. If I asked for alcohol, it'd come 30 seconds later. Because <laughs> they knew that would create drama. But, but, but any time. And let's face it, you asked for alcohol. But, but, but <laughs> I was in drinking back then. Oh, really? Until I started stand-up. Oh, I became started. an alcoholic. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, it's so easy to fucking drink yes. at night doing this. Oh, Just think it. of any time you add Wait, want a glass? somebody to come live at your place. Like, 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 imagine living with someone you don't even know. Even someone you, like, sort of know. Like, even we know each other, right? I don't know if I want to live with no, you guys. No, no. Oh, no, That's I know. So it's always I a nightmare. Oh, yeah. man, Eric's burping in the other room and oh, shit. Yeah. He's shitting with his feet up, like whatever he oh, does. God, yeah. Oh, yeah, on a poop thing. Yeah, yeah. no. That's why you're not shitting. Eric, what is, this is me. Eric, what is this? <laughs> All the time. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm just like, that, yeah, just, there's just Tupperware yeah, in the yeah, refrigerator. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What is this, dude? Imagine living with <laughs> yeah. Nick. He's just up all out oh, of the night how about betting. Is, but his dumb dogs will be all over the yeah, place, yeah, yeah. and he's not giving them attention. <laughs> I, can't wear, you, you, I can't believe you wear black and you have all those dogs. Yeah, you know what? Only one of my dog sheds. Oh, they're all hyper yep. allergic? Mm-hmm. Oh, well. Yeah, so. And, and, and uh, he's a lot of, of black, so. Can't see it. Camouflage doggy. <laughs> guys, let's take a break. Let's take a break. You guys know what HelloFresh is, or do you live under a rock? I know. What You're talking Hello about Fresh that is. home delivery food. Yeah, you get fa- you get, look with HelloFresh. You get farm fresh, pre-portioned ingredients and seasonal re- recipes delivered right to your doorstep. It's so easy. Skip trips to the grocery stores and count on HelloFresh to make your home cooking easy, fun, and affordable. Yeah, but if you don't like saving money, that's fine. But ha- HelloFresh is seventy-two percent cheaper than dining at a restaurant. It's even cheaper than going to the freaking grocery store. That's money back in your pocket. Money back in your pocket. It's so easy. Whatever you're on, whatever diet you're on, we got you covered. They have over fifty different weekly options. You can skip weeks if you need to. Change your delivery date. Update your whatever you want. Uh, they have a HelloFresh app. 
happy. You can do it all right there. All right. They sent me some food. They sent me the meals. My girl can't get enough of it. Now we're never eating out. I'm kind of disappointed. Whatever. It's still delicious. Go to HelloFresh.com slash King16. Use the code King16 for up to 16 free meals and three free gifts. That is HelloFresh.com slash King16. Use the code King16 for up to 16 free meals and three free gifts. All right. King16. Don't write out 16. You know what I mean? Oh, I got you. Yeah, it's just like you'd say King16. That's yep. the code. HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit. Fellas. Have you ever used those dick enhancers at the gas station like Rhino 3000? Ooh, I'm always scared. Dude, of I could see the moon, and I was rock hard, and I thought I was going to have a heart attack. Yeah, it's, they're not that good, it's right? It's not healthy uh, for you. Uh, yeah, I no. took one once, and then I woke up in a whole different state. So, yeah. 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 I was in, yeah. It's not good, <laughs> I was man. in Wyoming. I, was, I had never been to Wyoming. I'll never, kind of what? I'll but, never yeah. do it again. That's uh-huh. why I trust Joy Mode. Yep, it's here to save the day. All right, whether you're happy or unhappy with your performance in the sack, why not perform better? Hey, guys, I care about your wieners out there. Thanks. Joy Mode sexual performance. Boosters like a pre workout, but for sex. That's right, man. Joy Mode is all natural. It's backed by science. We got you covered, man. All right. After taking the sexual performance booster, blood levels just climb. It's just the crazy. Roof. People people go like to, 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 at lengths to better their mental health and well being. Dude, what about when you want to lay horizontal? You know what I mean. What Yo, about when you want to make that mattress go e on? You need performance. E on. What about your wiener? Exactly. Don't yeah. forget about your wiener. Want to spice it up in the bedroom and boost your sexual performance and do it naturally without the nasty prescription drugs? Cool. Here's an offer for the King of Sting and the Wing and the Sing audience. Go to usejoymode.com slash K-A-T-S or enter K-A-T-S at checkout for 20% off your first order. That's usejoymode.com slash K-A-T-S for 20% off your order. Thanks, Thanks Joy, Joy Mode. Mode. Wiener. Thank you. What do you got, Nick? <laughs> This wasn't even planned. But. This guy has a strong chin, too. What's up, boys? This is Paxton from Dallas, Texas. Great Sorry day. for the glitchy video. Fucking company got me working on this stupid-ass fucking Android. Jesus. I got a little debate club Jesus. for y'all. Wow, aggressive. Reality TV shows. Oh, wow. Swamp People versus Duck Dynasty. I know Theo's not on anymore, so this is probably up his alley, but fuck him. All right, boys. <laughs> gang, gang. Both, Jesus, both, this guy's really sword, aggressive. Sing, all that shit. Uh, this guy cusses yeah. a lot. He's so aggressive. What's up, yeah. fuck faces? He's Love like, the fucking yeah, show. Like my stupid job with this dumbass Android. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's so aggressive. The two shows he named, I don't watch. I know reality TV. I used to love. I it. didn't even but know. I, you, but Chris had a good point. I'd watch. I'm like. I'm not learning shit here. I'm just watching these dummies act dumb. I was about it's to such say, a waste of time. Anytime you have some like what's redneck, the three of us on the right redneck white people yeah. in their element? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's good. Too. Oh, you like that? <laughs> yeah, mm. that's yeah. Chris, Eric, yeah. and Brendan. Yeah, yeah, that's the three of us. I mean, yeah. Chris on the left. Yeah, you know which one I am. Yep, you're the one with the hair. You're the skinnier. Um, you're the skinnier one. Well, I'm the one I with guess. the beard, mm-hmm. and you're like the. I'm on the far right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's with my the face. tattoos. And yeah, that's my face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the cut off shirt. Yeah. Clearly doing most I, of the work. I, I don't, I, look, I, I'm legally. I was what? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if you got that. <laughs> Led such a delayed reaction. <laughs> like, I, I didn't had to process it. that. <laughs> you just you were you you're the one did. cutting meat in a fucking bib. Yeah, yeah. that's you. I, what I I was Chris is the comic relief on the left. Clearly, <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, so hold on, <laughs> cut off overalls. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I think that's kind of a cool outfit. That's right? what I was yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like overalls. I, I don't on love that, that right? they're shorts, but you know, I wore overalls as a kid. I would wear overalls, but wait, hold on. So I don't know swamp people. They got canceled. The Duck Dynasty got canceled, right? Because like, they said something racist. Yeah. Well, oh, I mean, yeah, I mean dude. but also, <laughs> they should like, call it the racism hour. I, I'm just saying, like, you're in your, it's you're so in a, stupid, you know, dude. you're, you don't, there's not a lot of uh, ethnic people even around you. You have your own ideas and you're comfortable and you're just going to be like, bow. Yeah. I mean, like they do was delivering the package. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he shaved and became an Amazon yeah. delivery guy. Yeah. <laughs> But also look I'm at their even mad at it. look I at know, their beards. Of course they use the N word. Well, yeah, but the beards say the N word. Look at everything. The look American at, at, flag I mean, on the, the, the guy's got an American flag on his head. It's not even a hat. Well, I like that. Yeah, no, I'm not saying it's bad. I, but, I like the guys on the right. They're, they have a gator farm. I've never seen either of the shows. I'm not into that. This, I could get those guys on the right fucking laughing. Those guys on the left, I can't get them laughing. No, that's a tough crowd on the left. <laughs> yeah, they go what? What? They're, they're real serious. What? That's the your crowd in Fort Wayne, Indiana, on the left. It was tough, fellas. Yeah. Yeah. On the right, I got. They go. This guy's cra- crazy. What the? The, what ones, the, the fuck? ones on the left, it's like chin is on the far right. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
<laughs> like Nick the, is the, the guys on the right the after the show, the you're you're getting some beers and going gator hunting. The guys on the left go like this. We don't take too kindly joking like that. Yeah. And you're like, what? I was talking about. I was making jokes about IKEA, and they say we get furniture from there, boy. <laughs> boy. Like, well, what the fuck can I make fun of? I wouldn't. I wouldn't even try. <laughs> not around these parts. What? what? Yeah. <laughs> Boy, you're on. Nick, they were not even close to a fucking IKEA. Nick, I feel like you tune into Duck Dynasty or like Swamp Boys or whatever. I thing. never watched either he, of that. He went to fucking Duck Dynasty Con <laughs> with a fake beard. Yeah. It's called <laughs> a, a earpiece. It's, it's called a KKK. Yeah, right? yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Like a, it's like a Santa Claus beard. Yeah. You know? <laughs> But it was the Swamp People was the first show on History Channel, so it basically ruined the History Channel from being any history education from being history. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. That's well, the thing about these fucking channels; it's hilarious. They, they all become all the same in. thing, dude. There's yeah. no history on History Channel. No, no, there's no, no. no music on MTV. There's yep. no comedy on Comedy Central. Oh there's no God. weather on the Weather Channel. There's no learning on the Learning there's Channel. There's no news dude, on the news. Locked and loaded. How yeah. did you get it? There's no locked? news on the news. Well, yeah. well. Fake news. Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying, but it's not real, yeah. You're, no, dude, to your point. On the Weather Channel, it's like Ice Road Truckers and all that kind of stuff's going on mm, on the Weather yeah. Channel. The oh. Learning Channel is like a just a, just any little people, little people doing little people shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? You, you know mean what kids mean? or you mean like midgets? No, the, well, you can't say that, but okay, little people, you know. yeah. Okay, editor. No, <laughs> I think you can say I it. I think you can say <laughs> it. Honestly, if I was a little person, I'd rather be called the, the an, a midget than a little person. I, it's, it's yeah, don't call me little. Or dwarf or whatever. Yeah, call me yeah. What am I? What am I in Lord of the Rings? Yeah, dwarf. I know. I don't like that either. It's too. When you call it somebody a dwarf, it sounds it sounds too science fiction. Yeah, you gonna be like hello. Might as well call me yeah, a wizard yeah, 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 instead yeah. of like you know the right. N word. Right. How, how, how do we feel about <laughs> troll? How do we feel about troll? Yeah, troll. Well. <laughs> <laughs> hey, check out this fucking wizard. <laughs> Hey, wizard. Hey, we don't take too kindly to wizards around here. Can you imagine if hey, me and my friend. get my broom. You shall not pass. <laughs> me and my friend Greg, man, he's a troll. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Probably offensive. Yeah. What was that show with the dude from. He, he. Oh, man. What was that? Oh, my God. What does it do? This real skinny dude. And he had a. a, a this, Reality show? This, no, it was like a comedy show, but he was like, yeah. I, I was dating a troll, and then it was like a real troll. Oh, <laughs> not Tom like, Green? No, no, no. It wasn't it's Tom a scripted Green. Show. It's a scripted yeah, yeah, show. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know man. it. I don't know I the name funny. of that guy. Oh. He was like this skinny guy in a bunch. He's a weird skinny guy in a bunch of movies. No, it was like this weird abstract show. I wish I could yeah. remember the name of it. He's really mm-hmm. dating a troll. Yeah, you know, that was the joke. That's he was like, Rod Man Doing was it that one? Yeah, he's like on Comedy it's, it's like a real troll. Mm-hmm. I think it was on Comedy Central, mm-hmm. but it was like so funny. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Is it possibly called Man Seeking Woman? I don't know if this is. Yeah, let me see the guy, the star. Yeah, yeah, that. Wait, wait. Well, make it yeah, bigger. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this fucking thick guy, Nick. No, I can't say. No, he's, he's trending on thin I wasn't ice. ready. Yes. <laughs> Jay, what's his face? Yeah, For this is show. it. Man seeking woman. Wow, dude. Nick, okay, wow. Nick, that was a good pull. You know what, dude? I take <laughs> oh, it back. Oh, that's the guy from uh, uh, yeah. She's you. Out of My League. There it is right there. Yeah. He's that was like, his girl? He's like dating a real <laughs> troll. Jesus you know, Christ. And every, oh, and another, one, another funny one they had on there was like, his sister, somebody's like dating, like Hitler's still alive, uh-huh. and he's in like a, you know, and he's like, you know, he's like, you know, <laughs> and, and, then, and then they're like, you know, uh, it's just funny. It was a really funny abstract show. You oh, gotta watch I, that. I, I got back from my hotel. There is him right there. Yeah, this is. <laughs> That's supposed to be Hitler with that mustache. That's funny. Yeah. And he's like, you know, uh, they be. <laughs> yeah, Eric Andre was on that. Oh, I love Eric. Such a good dude. Yeah, that was one of those like. Was the thing. There was a. Uh, yeah. Oh, sorry. Shout you know, out to that the, show. That? You know what movie I, I came home to? It was just on. I left the the TV on it in my hotel. I come back and I was like, I had my food there. It was like one oh. in the morning. I'm like, I've seen this fucking thing. It was from the '80s, right. and I was like, man, this, this. Why do I know this so well? It was my favorite movie as a kid. This is why I have CT. It was my favorite movie as a kid. I was like, I've seen this. I knew everything coming up. I right, tell us the movie. It was He-Man. It was He-Man. Oh. Remember the original with Dolph? Yeah. Dolph, 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 Dolph. Dolph. <laughs> that was terrible. Well, I mean, I, as I, a kid, I it was lit. I was eight. Me too. Yeah. Now it's like Jesus I thought it was Christ. terrible then. Wow. Well, you're fuck also 40 then. This. Fuck this, just as a little kid. Yeah. Dude, we were put on Urban Myths. Shut up. <laughs> Urban Myths movie trailer. Have you seen this, bro? Just look at this movie trailer. Okay. Right, there we go. Go ahead. Uh, Have you seen this? Shit? Hi, can I help you? I'm looking for Dave. So, Bob Dylan, great. <laughs> Cary Grant, Dr. Leary, I'm it. Sam Beckett, I do not know so good well. acting. I will introduce Garfield myself as Adolf, that's why I thought about it. Academic paper. Hitler's Mr. friend, Rupert. Taylor. You caught me, Elizabeth Taylor looking great. Ready for the final. Brian Cox, Marlon Brando. Ray Fiennes is playing Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. <laughs> Where is this Dave? is Voldemort. I'm Dave. 
Why did you start taking LSD? To feel more like Carrie This is just five years ago. They would never do that now, right? They can't do that. They are horses. Oh, it's Rupert Grant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, oh my <laughs> God! Look at his nose. <laughs> look at it. <laughs> look at it. It's like South Park. Yeah. yeah. And you watch the show? No, no, it's a movie. I never saw it. I just seen the movie. I saw it the other day. Oh, you did see the movie? No, no, no. The the trailer. This. Yeah. Yeah, just the trailer. It's funny. This looks. But yeah. That looks well, European it, though. That looks like they made that for like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. that's British. That would be on the BBC. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just yeah. crazy though. Oh, he's dude. a great actor. I love that. Guy. Oh yeah, he's great. He was actually good in uh, Schindler's the, List. Yeah, he was English good. Patient. Um, I mean, this that, guy's after been Red Dewey, Dragon. After yeah, doing Red Schindler's Dragon, he was List, great in. he 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 got he got typecast as like the, the villain Nazi? guy, a villain. Mm. Yeah, yeah. His, mm. It's hard for him not to play anything but that. It's weird too because he's such Kanye's a charming, handsome actor. dude, you know. Yeah. yeah. But, but his brother Joe finds is uh, he, he he had a moment there. He does was he in... does he have an actual uh, Cliff Lip? Who? Or is it him? The, the, the actor? No. 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 Ray Fiennes. No. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. It's stupid. By the way, uh, shout! I gotta say this. I wanna say on the podcast too is like. I just got back from Skankfest and it was a blast. Really, I was gonna. I want to, cause so I know I don't really know anything about. It. It's so funny. I I went to uh, follow uh, uh, Luis G Gomez, uh -huh. right? And uh, because his he commented on my thing something nice about how I had, like my, my son was cute. Yeah. And I was like, oh, that's fucking Luis. So I followed him, and uh, and I looked, and this was October. 16th I followed him and the only reason why I know this is cuz I I had a DM from him after I started following him he's like hey if you if you, this was back in like m March he was like you should do Skankfest this year uh it's from October 14th to October 16th and I followed him on October 16th <laughs> how, how, how weird is that but I got I'm telling you right now it was a blast it's a great comic hang and all of the people that are there the they they are true Podcast yeah. comedy fans. Yeah, <laughs> bless you. It's like it's like yeah, Comic Con like or something like that, you know. So it's really. Cool. I've, I've heard it's dope. It's a yeah, really good dope. time, yeah. and I want to just give a shout out to all the people that came. There were a lot of mm. great fans there, and it's like I said, it's also a great like hang, hang out with, yeah. with people yeah. that I was like, where do you get a hang? Better at? than say Montreal. I'm just saying because that's what I'm saying. Where do you get a hang out as a comic? That's what I mean. And without having that sort of feeling like there's some hierarchy and pre it was just so chill. Yeah, well, that's the thing about that is like. I was thinking about this, like when it comes to comedy festivals, like they're always trying to get the, the comedy festivals are usually trying to get the biggest names, right? Like, and Skankfest has this, I, I know nothing about it, but I, I just saw the videos that he was posting and like, they have this, um, it's always good to be the guy who, like, it's not as big as Montreal, right? Of course. But JFL's that's, been around that's good though. It's yeah, it good is. because it's like I was talking to. Um, but man, Jim Norton was there. Because Hollywood, no, 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 they have Tim big Dillon guys with, there. Tim they have Dillon, T.J. Miller. But, but I bet, but I bet uh, Chris Rock or something would right, be right, like, right. I don't. Uh, why would I do that? Or like you Trevor know? Noah, like absolutely. And, and, and who yeah, headlined? Of course, Tower, but yeah. that's but that's good though. That's good. Skankfest doesn't want that. And, and no, they want the comics. Chris Rock's my favorite comic, so I'm not saying. But like Skankfest wants that whole like. Here we are, motherfuckers. Like yeah. these guys the don't outcast. do our it's exactly. Like, yeah, Hollywood's not that's fucking a, with that's us. That's a very so cool ourselves. thing, that's and it's also cool started by the comics, right? I know, mm -hmm. but what I'm saying though is like I would also dig if like someone like Chris Rock was like, hey, I don't want to deal with this other thing. I want I want to go be you know, and then he, oh, of course, that's yeah. what I'm saying. But you know, yeah, you don't want it to turn into like too. But Hollywood. anyways, you I, just, I, just wanna give him, I just want to give him a shout yeah, out, yeah. Lewis, Big J, yeah. all the people that were a part yeah. of it that made it. Soder was there too. Yeah, they, yeah, that's and it was a good hang it's like that. Denver Soda boy. was there. Big J's was, great comic. All those people were there. Jay, he did his special Big, there. Big J did. Yeah. Oh Mon yeah, yeah, yeah. Big J's on the special. Monster. So it was just like, I, how do you I, start a festival? You do. You just go, hey, we're gonna go here. You put it out on the internet, like, hey, we're gonna go, we're gonna be here, mm -hmm. and then the people just come, man. Red they buy their passes, the passes, and it was. It was but jam packed. They had so fights. Good. They had like yeah, that shit fights. Is, to me is crazy. It was so uh, funny. It was it, like was it? Were yeah. people getting hurt? No, they oh. were making. They were it was amateur. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it was just amateur. Yeah, that seems to get, crazy. Because it's not commission, so I'm sure it's just fucking around. It's just messing around. Sounds like a good time. And they had it at this location in downtown Las Vegas. They so they took over this sort of like three level area that had theaters and stuff, and there was like a a, a center area where they had to fight. Everybody was lined up. It was jam packed. But but here's the thing. All the shows were great. Yeah, well, they got good comedy. Uh, no, that it doesn't matter. Oh, you oh, you mean they it were at the vibes? Okay, I'm, I'm saying because when you're in Montreal, man, you know how the, it's some it, are nice. No, I know, I know. They're sensitive know, and all this kind of stuff. No, these are comedy fans. Yeah, that's so awesome. every show was good. Every show was at those, like those festivals. A, some of, some of the rooms you go. Dude, in, I had a one o'clock. I had a one o'clock in the afternoon show. 
And you would be like, one o'clock? Dope. Pack. Whoa. Everybody. Because they're there all day. They want this. That they, sounds crazy. Do they sound, fly? Sounds cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to yeah, no, I'm not saying it sounds. It just sounds. So, that sounds like. like I think. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm gonna I'm gonna get these guys. We'll figure it out. You right. know what I mean? Yeah. We'll figure I, it I out. Mean, Skank Fest coming to you, 2023. Well, so do they do it different places every year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Even though I think they should still, I think they should do it. Vegas, in Vegas. sounds like the place to do it. Should, they should do it in Vegas, especially because, dude, great. Vegas. Unless it's like, I mean, Vegas doesn't really. I, I don't know. Maybe it has a scene, but like the scene in Vegas is like this theater. Fucking this guy's it's coming. Jay Leno. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Right. Segura has residency there though. Yeah, but oh, they have wise guys there now. This was in downtown. Off the right, strip, right, right, downtown's right. a whole Polish different vibe. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Downtown's a different. That's where the locals. Downtown's go. where yeah. you want to be. Yeah, downtown's where the locals the go. Yeah. You know that's where mean? wise guys is downtown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. Doing, and which I will be at November 18th <laughs> and 19th. Wise guys, there you go. coming mm-hmm. to Vegas. Mm-hmm. Whoa, whoa, whoa! All right, cool. Let's see what uh, Scooby Doo girl wants. That was pretty. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Roxy. And I have a debate club for you. Sorry, guys. I'm extremely nervous. I, I love tell. you guys. And I listen to you guys all the time. Um, so I'm kind of shaky. Um, so over the weekend, uh, James Corden was banned from oh, yeah. a New York restaurant. Yeah. And he profusely apologized to the owner to let him back. Uh, he was being extremely rude to the waiters and the staff members there. And so after apologizing, the owner said he could go back he unbanned him so my debate club is would you unban him or would you keep him banned and make him learn his lesson uh gang gang buzz buzz Here, look, look i'm not i i don't i i have a i don't know james corden i i i've seen him he seems like a guy who behind closed doors is a an asshole that's what he seems like he seems like a guy that other British people would go like, ah, oh, that fucking cunt. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like they just, I, I they guarantee no British dudes like him. How? Oh, that <laughs> daft cunt. He's daft. He's daft. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, I, I, you know, it's like I couldn't. He, look, he got big in. Okay, he had one show in Britain. Like this is what they were, and it was great. And a fucking and the second, and it's like, is he fat or not? It's like make up your mind. It's mental. So like, it's mental. Like uh. so, uh, so he's he. Look at this. They, they, but okay, so I looked into this because I talked about it on congratulations in my podcast. I, 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 this is the kind of thing though that it's. Dude, he was a dick kind of to a waiter, and now it's all over TMZ and shit. Well, but why would you, he was rough with? And then he goes, "If you don't give uh, me and my wife free drinks, and all the other drinks are in the house, I would hate to leave a Yelp review for you." Of course, dick, dick. And so that guy was like, "Well, before you do it, I'm gonna go out and before you get me and ruin my business." Right. But my whole point is this social media bitch shit. Just handle it with each other. Dude, this whole up because now this guy Keith McNally or whatever fucking knows if he goes on, it's gonna make headlines. It's fucking bitch shit. Walk up to me like, yo, motherfucker, leave leave a yelp group. That's a dick move, you know. If you do that, I'm gonna ban yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Well, or you can be okay. cool. Can I be devil's advocate over here, please. please? Do. Of course. Thank you. <laughs> um, what recourse does regular people have of somebody that they perceive as with this sort of influence and, uh, you know. A Yelp review from him is going to go viral and yeah, fuck I'm, the guy's business. Saying, so, like, they said, okay, here's how we're going to combat this. We're going to combat this. Like, people are now like, hey, be nice to people because it's going to get out. No, no, no. I, I agree. It's kind of like, but I'm Ellen, with, listen, listen, listen by the way, yeah. I'm with you yeah. on, like, let's say when people don't tip and, yeah. then, and then they're like. They're, 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 they're posting that on yeah. the internet. Yeah. Like, Chris D'Elia doesn't tip. Right, look at, right, look at right. this receipt. Right. Okay, I don't like that. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. at the same time, hey, tip. No, I understand that. But like, it's the only recourse they have. I, I get it. But like these, are, these two instances, if you read these two instances, one of them is like, all right. You fucked up the order. Yeah. He could have been nice The other it. one, it, it, what if he had a, f- dude, what if, I mean, you don't know what the fucking person's going through. But twice though, Chris, that's but, the only but, thing. But, like but once, the, I forgive. Twice, right, I'm like, hey, I, dude. I understand, but the other one isn't as bad if you don't have the first one. But the, you do have the first one. And that's I, what the guy's going off of. Yeah, I understand. But but my point is, t- one of them, to me, he was a big dick. The other one, he wasn't, he was like, kind of like. At the same right, place? Bro. Yes. Yeah. Which okay? So which, the waiter was shaking. Which action came first, the smaller one and then the big one? Like he was no. like giving the guy a chance. B- big one, then smaller one. 
Okay, here's the thing, man. I mean, I, I, I was in Vegas one time, mm -hmm. and uh, one of the owners of the Palms, those brothers. The Maloofs. Maloof brothers. Mm -hmm. I like to play craps. Mm -hmm. I'm at a craps table. Mm -hmm. One of the Maloof brothers walks up. And my goodness, man. Smell he was nice. losing, okay? Oh. And then he's like, what the fuck? And, and he was like, I don't want to look at her. He was talking about one of the people that works there. She Move like, her. Well, Move that, her out yeah, of the yeah, way, yeah. you know? Yeah, and the guy was like. Does she look like a troll, though? No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, you're right. That's stupid. It doesn't. Man. Come on. Uh, yeah. no, no, it's somebody's you know I mean? wife. Yeah. And what I'm saying is, so like, he was clearly exercising his yeah, wealth, his power, his shitty, influence, yeah, and he yeah. was being a dick yeah, he owns without it. any recourse. Nowadays, yeah. mm -hmm. if somebody would have been filming that and they put it out, it's like, hey, fuck you. Don't be like that. Yeah. Right. I mean, so I what guess, I'm saying I guess, is, it's the good and bad. You don't of it. like the bitch. I shit. guess, I guess, no. I guess actually, what I'm getting at is, sorry. I guess actually, <laughs> what I'm getting at is, he was a dick. What a nice moment. This guy <laughs> calls the dude out for being a dick. Okay, so that's shitty. And then, and then, this whole people saying fuck James Corden. Yes. That's that's. You don't like that. That's you it's like, like the mob mentality. Yeah, it's like they got to deal with it. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to but say. But the thing this is, is, a two -man this, issue. is a, this is a do you know who I am situation. Yeah, right. Like, do you know who yeah. I am? I should be treated yeah. extra special. Mm -hmm. Now, and if, that's what that is. If James Corden's mean to her, out. then I'm pissed. I know. I, it's, if I, he's mean to her, it's it's the good and bad of social media. It's like a mm. double edged sword, mm. and it sucks. Yeah. I who, think it's it little, little boozy. Yeah, yeah, said, yeah, I hear you. I'm little, with you. I yeah, think I it sucks, fellas. Can we take another little break? We're having so much fun on the new set. UFC 280 is here. UFC 280 is here. Get closer to the octagon with DraftKings Sportsbook, the official sports betting partner of UFC. Right now, new customers can bet $5 on UFC 280 and get, <laughs> check this out, $200 in free bets if your fighter wins. Okay? Wow. I'll tell you who's going to make money. Eric knows a thing or two about fighting now. I'm we starting to. I'm starting to. night too. flashbacks. He knows his thing. So if you want to bet, do it with DraftKings Sportsbook, all right? And you want even more action, say less. You can also double your winnings on a same-game parlay. Combine multiple bets, like which fighter will win, what? how long the fight will last, and what more. What interests you? What matchups? Charles Oliveira. Right, there you go. Getting Ooh. it done under five rounds against Makachev. He's a dog, and he could do it, all right? So there's and your also bet right like there. Sean there's Brady. your pick right I like there, everybody. Sean Brady, get it done via submission under the three rounds, all right? Everyone who wants to boost their winnings plays a two UFC 280 same game parlay today. Download DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use promo code KATS. Throw down five dollars on UFC 280 and get two hundred dollars in free bets if your fighter wins. That's code KATS this Saturday. Remember, it's 11 a.m. Pacific start time for the main card. And remember, minimum age and eligibility restrictions apply. See yep. show notes for details. Yeah. Little Boozy had a good thing on social media. He's like, it's only made things worse for everybody. Mm. Yeah, he's like, if you think about it, social media has not done. Society any good? Mm. He was rappers getting killed more than often. Mm. The hate is more yeah, than often. True. We hate each other. You know, uh -huh. it's dividing everybody. Mm. He's like, it, social media has done way worse than yeah. it's done good. What I'm saying is like, like I think unless like, you got to promote dates. If, if you can't I'm Salt Lake City, that, if you can't say, say, oh by the way, Seattle, I'm at Seattle. My <laughs> Seattle tickets are almost gone. Chris Lee. See, and that's go where ahead. social media helps. I know, I know. Yeah, there we go. Look at you. Look at you. You're taking advantage of it right now. I know. If somebody filmed them being mean to me, then I'm going to put that on. But you know what I mean? You fucking wizard. We put it out yeah. every week. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, but I know what you were saying in your head. <laughs> Everybody does. <laughs> um, Anyways, social media, whatever. So yeah, let, yeah, look, let him back. Unban him. He was being a dick. But that's he what he did. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He apologized. No, no, I know. She's saying, should he have? Oh, yeah. I, I think I, you should. It's yeah. weird to hold that resentment against yeah. someone. It only hurts you. Now, James Corden's feeling like this. Every place he goes now, he's going to be like, hello. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> hello. Hey, but you know what? I'm not a daft calm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's going to be at this table being like, let's do table karaoke. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> the new show. Yeah. <laughs> no, he, but also he should. Oh, you mean you now you're on the spotlight? You got to be nice. You have all the money in the world. That's be what fucking I'm cool, saying. dude. But also don't have tits like that, right? Ooh. Right? Well, wow. I mean, now I have the same shirt on as him, whatever. I think it's more about the shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. It's about the shirt. <laughs> Fuck. Well, that's when he was angry. That's why he was angry. You know, I don't he know looks angry on the right. Is it cold or is he happy to see me? <laughs> oh, I have you that jacket. I mean? Go back. Go back. Go back. That I Gucci have that one? jacket on the left. I, I, know. <laughs> I have that jacket, dude. <laughs> and I asked you what size uh, it was because I wanted to buy it. I know, I know, I know. Yeah. It's good. Boy, he was thick. Yeah. Let's just handsome guy. Who knows, man? I don't know him. He's probably a nice guy. Who fucking knows? He's nice. I I don't judge people. Oh, you did? Yeah, oh, he said. Show? He, I, I remember I, after I finished my set, he comes over to me and he whispers. He's like, "That was that was the best comedy I've ever seen on the show." Aww. And I was like, "You say that all the time." 
only two other times. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's funny. I, I, he's great at that. Yeah, yeah, I mean, he's, good, he's yeah. not doing it anymore. He's, yeah. This is last year. but I remember nice. George Lopez. I did George Lopez when he had that late night show. Yeah. I did his set. and uh, Actually, funny with that because I, I did, um, you know, those jo- the, the job of segment producer. They'll come around and they'll be like, I want to check out your set for the fucking late night oh, shows. Right, I don't yes. know if you know, people know this or not. Uh, it's not a job. It's it's not a job. It's like <laughs> it's like the movie Hitch with Will Smith. It's like that's not a job people have. I don't like these movies in Hollywood of like these made up jobs. It's like Hitch. He helps people. This doesn't exist. Don't make. What was the the? It's called a life coach. No, yeah, but it but it's not though. It's it's this guy's. But g- Hitch is making him look cool. My point is. My point is. Um, the, this segment producer will say, "Hello, comedian. I work for Jimmy Kimmel." I want to come see your five-minute act and see if it's suitable for our audiences. You go on stage as the 15-year vet comedian, fucking do your best five minutes, you murder, and then they say, what if you try and you're just like, you're not a comic. Ooh, bro. Ooh, yeah, I totally. Right? Okay, right. Yeah. So, so I was going to do Lopez Tonight was what it was called. Yeah. And the the segment producer was like, "We want you to do Lopez Tonight. Why don't you why don't you come do uh 5 minutes? We're going to come see your your act." So the guy comes, I do my my 5 minutes I think would be good. I crush. Um and he says, "Um why don't you uh not do the first part?" Because I don't know if that's going to be good for our audience. It wasn't for any reason then he said, uh, I don't know if the George Lopez audience will like that. Just men- meaning, I don't know if they'll think it's funny. Yeah. So I go, okay, I won't do that part. And he says, great, you're hired. I do the show and I do that part. Of course. That's what because we do. I I do this. Yeah. They're going to like it. Yes. Yeah. I, I crushed, and then and then Lopez came up to me after he was like, that was the best set we've ever had. And I remember how fucking good that felt, dude. I like, because I was a young comic, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and like, you know, I don't know who had done the show before, but like, man, it felt so fucking good. Can you, the late night? Is it, well, wait, wait, if you do sets you on late night? The, well, well, hold on. One no, I never saw him again. Oh, but I say, you didn't see him there? I, I probably did, but I was just, you know, I was like, okay, you know, like. Well, to, to the guy's credit, the guy from James Corden, that, that guy. Uh-huh. He was saying to me, like, oh, no, do that. Like, uh, I had some edgy stuff, and he was like, no, nah, do it. Cool. It's going to be, yeah, so. My shit wasn't even edgy. Look at you. You look so Armenian. Were you nervous for this? <laughs> yeah, you look I like Sam right I there. I don't know if I was you know nervous. I was probably nervous. <laughs> but but once you get the first live, it was such a great crowd. Wow, that's cool. I look cool. Yeah, Chris Tucker <laughs> on there, too. What? Okay, so you said now you, you know who's on my James there. Corden. Chris Tucker on there. I had it. Oh, yeah. Do you have oh, long hair too? Man, your hair. Now, can, can your you see hair good. It looks is good. out of control. It's too much. But, but what, this what, is when I used to That was 2017. Yeah. That's 2017. Now. Mm, cool. Uh, Who's yeah. Cuter? Two guys. Who did it cuter? That's the poll. <laughs> you your hair was long. Yeah, it was long, man. huh? Jesus Christ. I wish you would put on a ponytail. No, it, that doesn't look good with me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then it's just all for him. Yeah. That's no. what I want. Yeah. yeah. I, uh, and in fairness, that's what he wants. All right, let's see what's going on here. What do you got? He looks like a parrot. You know what I mean? Pair with a so what is it? What so is that God. bird that has the cockatoo? Thing like this? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Brendan knows his birds. Wow. Yeah. Brendan. What's up, guys? I got a debate club for you today. So, would you rather be attacked by a bear on the side of a mountain, like in that viral video, or would you rather be sued for a billion dollars, like Alex Jones? Both are pretty bad. Um, yeah, bear. I'd have to do the bear attack because I don't have that much money. Yeah, but you um, know, love you guys. Awesome. Come to Helium and Philly yeah. sometime. I'll buy tickets for all of you. Um, gang, gang, buzz, buzz, soar, and a woo, 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 woo. Wow, well, all the same note. Um, yeah. How did he? Like he was pressing one button. Brad, woo, woo, woo. Brad Garrett and uh, Raymond in the Raymond show. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> um, yeah, dude, this this attack is absolutely insane. It's oh. a smaller bear. Oh. I, yeah, but. Ah! That bear was just ah! playing. Ah! I don't know if he's trying to eat his ass. Ah! No, 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 the bear was just playing. It's a baby ah! bear. My concern ah! is that the real bear is around, ah! is around there. Well, that's yeah. what they said. They ah! said he ran into a ah! mama bear and the cub. Ah! That was the little one. Ah! Uh, maybe he was a plant. Ah! Um, but the mama bear, you don't want ah! that mama bear. He turns around, the mama bear is just like this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because the mama bear was teaching this one, go get him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Teach him how to kill shit. Well, first of all, I'll take the billion dollars because 
you don't have a billion dollars. Alex Jones doesn't have I know, a billion I know, dollars. I know. Yeah, but they're going to garner gonna be, your wages for the rest of your exactly, life. Exactly. He's going to be living in a You're going to be paying that. Life. Th- maybe you can't pay a billion, but you'll be paying. I wonder what it is like if you make if you make 20 million in a year. There's how, a limitation. Okay. Yeah. I actually had dinner with Alex Jones. He has to live. I had dinner with Alex Jones. Recently? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. He has to live, though, right? You can't but, just. So, so, like in the state of Texas, they sued. He lost right. the trial there. They, they, whatever, he got sued for, let's say, 55 uh-huh, million. Right. The limitation he has to pay is 5 million. So he can't pay more than five million. That's the limitation. The state of Texas. A year. F- oh, so so it, they so on the news it says fifty five million, but, but he's really only paying five. He's he's on the hook for five the whole time. The whole life for life. Well, for life, he pays one time fees out. Right. I, in Connecticut, we don't know right. where where this happened. Right, right, I don't right, I don't know right. their limitation. Whoa! Oh, so he's gonna maybe may he could be fine in Texas. He's fine. I don't know how. Connecticut yeah, no, no, I works. understand. Yeah, well, I don't know. Is that is that right? Come, this guy does make up things. <laughs> It's what right? We looked it up. Oh, I, I looked right. it up. Right. Yeah, no, we fact checked them. Yeah, but this. Oh, the, oh, but, oh, 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 oh. Connecticut's oh. different. I don't know. Can, <laughs> I, I, Connecticut's not Texas. I don't know what their limitations. Can you imagine every time we you tried hang looking out with this up. Guy he, now you have to fact check everything he says. Ooh, I'm hungry. You're like, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's not Wait, even you gotta, dinner. Time. You gotta go. Like, you gotta check his pulse. <laughs> I think you. Wait a minute. You I saw you to a sandwich two and a half hours ago. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know how um, much you're not paying, but yeah, imagine you have to like live in like a two bedroom apartment. Well, that uh, and you yeah, made, you made a hundred million dollars and it all goes away. They they give you a little stipend to live. Yeah, and you have to like. Well, right, right. Like, you like, was just like I would just be like I'm not going to work anymore. I'm going to go live in the. Here's the king. You're singing. Who'd you rather be, Alex Jones or Kanye West right now? Oh, one. Yeah. They're both voted off the island, but Alex's island. Ooh. They, they, he's their mascot. Yeah, but same with Kanye, dude. Kanye's buying parlor. You see that? He uh, wants to buy the, the app yeah. parlor. Yeah. Um, I don't know, man. I'm a Kanye fan too. It's just like I'll see this stuff. I'm like, God damn. They'll find a, but say, they'll find a way to stop that too, though. What parlor? Yeah, they'll find a way to like, do, like they, they, the, all that's gonna do is trigger some sort of legislation about social media. That's all that's gonna do. What is? Oh, what's gonna do? If he let's say he buys parlor, yeah. and now he's gonna be able to go on parlor and be like the Jews. Then that's when people are going to be like, well, now we got to make laws about yeah, social media. Yeah, that's yeah, when yeah. Good, the good, limitations. Good. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't, good. What I don't understand is what, why do you want to like, it's like when I said this about, on my podcast as well, but like when you like these dudes who say, oh, I can't say the N word, uh, free speech though. It's yeah. like. I should be able to, you know, you shouldn't, be, you, you restrict words, then you start restricting, you know, and it's yeah. like, but why do you, First why amendment. do you want to say it that bad? And by the way, that's people that don't understand. Of course. The First Amendment. Correct. What it really means. Yeah, Correct. yeah, yeah. Because that's not what it means. It's no, just like, no, you no. can't, like they say, you can't call fire in a, fi- in a place yeah, yeah, that, yeah. and it causes harm. Right, right, right. You know, anyway. The, right. The point is, people don't understand that free speech means people have free speech to also not like yeah, your yeah, speech. Yeah, 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 right? Yeah, yeah. But anyways. Whatever. I just feel like. We're getting way too serious. Yeah. Though. You know. Yeah. Um. I'd rather be... You're making a lot let, of let points. Let answer today. the question. I'm like, making too many points. No, no. I'm, I'm not saying too many. I'm saying you're, you're point guy today. Oh, fuck. No, I, I enjoy point guy. Because you know uh, why? Because you started off with this. Because Chris do this. Yeah. Chris go, okay. I talk about my podcast, and then yeah. you give us a rant. Yeah. But I enjoy it. Oh, it's too See much, that? dude. I'm ow, your ow, that's assault. Dude, are you... Uh, Alex Jones or Kanye? Which one would you rather be? Kanye. I don't, I don't want to owe a billion dollars. Yeah, Kanye has a billion. Yeah, Alex does For now. I, oh, I saw an article. Kanye has more the than Chase Bank I saw thing. An, I saw an article today that he's talking. They're talking about he's bl- his people close to him. He's blowing through money. How about how about Chase Bank said? But I guess that was before this? this too. No, no, well, the anti-Semitic right. uh, like Jews Bank, dude. Yeah. So, so <laughs> that, that felt a little. That's that felt name, a that's like, racist. Wait, that sounds like the name of Chris's new rap album coming out. <laughs> Jews, Jews Bank. Bank. <laughs> That was aggressive, <laughs> but the guy's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. fuck all these, you know, and then yeah, and yeah. then ju- the, the, the people at the bank are like, here's Oi. your money. They should have given him his money in like like in pennies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And oh, like, here you go. Here, here's your <laughs> here's your hundred million dollars in dimes. Here Good you luck. go. Back up the truck. Yeah, yeah. Man. I, see, I thought the white lives matter and that stuff he did at that. I was like, all right, He's he should be all right. But He's then when, when he did the Jew thing, I'm like, now you fucked up. No, you know what? I you mess with you. the Jews, man, you fucked There's up. There's a point where I thought like maybe he's just playing with us, playing with the media, trying to make a mm. thing. But that's what I thought too, because the people are talking about yeah. him, and it's like that's what he's and known you, for. And you can't even stop him either, because even if you take him off Instagram, he just goes someplace and starts to talk, yeah. and everybody's yeah, yeah, filming yeah, him, and course. it's going on there, and it's yeah, exactly. still going out. But yeah, I think that I was like, what with the Jews? Not even just that. 
<laughs> when I saw the Jew thing, I was like, and, he's and fucked. And the George Floyd thing, I thought was like, what, Kanye, what, did he what are you doing? But he said he fentanyl killed George Floyd. He was on Floyd. fentanyl, and it wasn't like, he wasn't even on his neck like that. And it's like, dude, man, there's video. Oh, we wow. see it. It's like, but, what are you but, talking about? But uh, He was definitely on his neck, and then he was also on fentanyl. But all all this is, he's he's mentally ill. the point, though, to yeah. be clear. He's mentally ill. Yeah. He needs help. It's a little bit of my problem with this. Don't strike me. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. This is a little problem with, with this. That's right. okay. Is sometimes I do things and everyone's like, he's a genius. The other time, like, he's, he's out of his mm. mind. Yeah. It's like, well, so when is he a genius? When is he out of his mind? Mm. When he's having his manic episode, you don't like him? And then if he does something you like, he's a genius? You think he's a genius, and then, but he's talking about the Jews, though. You're, you're a No, man. hell no. But the, and then also some of the media outlets, they Chase never Bank. list him as being a genius. It's always, oh, he's having the, they yeah, only yeah, cover yeah, it when yeah. he's having this manic episode. It's not going to be like genius Kanye West talks negatively about Jews. Yeah. <laughs> then it's like, you could say, you could say, say you could say that. empire mogul Kanye yeah, yeah, West yeah, yeah. having a moment. I, I guess. He fucked up. The Jew thing, man, yeah, yeah, of course, he of course. It's up. awful. It's awful. It's awful. Well, I think all of this he's fucked up. I, now the other can, stuff you'd been okay. It's not good. No, no, no. But I was like, ah, all right, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. Then, well, you knew with, he was going to push it. With the Jew thing, though, I'm like, oh, my. And then he's doubling down on it. And then the George Floyd thing, I'm like, this isn't good. Yeah, I don't know what's going to happen. Because at a certain point, at a certain point. Chris has Yeezys on. There's a certain point that people are like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then they go, oh, man, I can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah now. Yeah. Because even with Alex Jones, um, even with Alex Jones, there's got to be a point where even his staunch followers is there any moment where they go, ah, oh, why'd you say that? Well, yeah, but I think families? I think that what happens is, you know? I think there's yeah. a difference between there's so. a difference between Kanye West and George Floyd, or uh, sorry, George Floyd, uh, Alex Jones. <clears throat> Alex Jones stands for something. It, 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 whether whether you agree with it or not, he thinks he stands for it, and so do his followers. Kanye West is just an artist, so I think that I think that I, I disagree. I think at, Kanye as of a business, late, as of late, he's come across like he stands for something too. What? This whole the whole thing about supporting Trump and the White Lives Matter, and but he flip flops like, too much. Alex Jones has yeah. been about one thing. He's been about freedom of speech and it's, for fucking years. And it's gonna so cost and conspiracy. No, it is and, and conspiracy theories. Well, it's the that's conspiracy stuff that's like you right, know. but that's free speech. So when he God, I'm making too many. I'm sorry, dude. I'm making too many. I want to be it's funny. A, it's the new set. It's, it's the new set. I know, but I, I want to be funny. Newsy. But it's too like, Fox. How about this? When's the last time you shit yourself? Let's go. Come on, we got it. We got it, dude. Now this is up my alley. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know I, that, dude. I remember going someplace. <laughs> All right, you know, go. and I Thank got God, and I got there. I got. I, <laughs> <laughs> I like how this begins. <laughs> it was like a forty. It was like a forty-five minute drive, and I got there, and I'm just about to get out the car, and I was like, "Oh, is this a fart?" You know what I mean? And I was yeah, like, yeah, yeah, just yeah. squeeze this yep. one out real that quick." Russian roulette. And it was like, it was like, oh, oh you know? no, and I was like, and I still wasn't sure. So I did a. Um, a <laughs> I would. I don't, I don't, I don't, how no. much would I pay to see your face? <laughs> like how Wait, much? But, would, I but it was like this. I had to go in. No. Oh, <laughs> Oh Wait, Chris. I went, in, I went in through the front, oh! and, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> and then I pulled out, and I was like, "Oh no!" I fucking shit myself. And then now I'm dealing with this. I got shit on my finger. <laughs> and, and you can't get rid of that smell. And it's no, human shit yeah. on your fingers. So, impossible. But, but here's the thing: I'm 40 minutes in. I can't turn around and go home. Yo, so you I, were in the car. So I went inside to the bathroom. You know what I mean? I took off my pants. You shit your pants. Yo, you I your took pants. off my underwear and I used the underwear to like finish yes. and clean up. Yes, yes, yes. You know, I cleaned up. I Toss threw that, that. away. Yep. And I you went are commando. So That's the gangster move. Bro. That's the gangster that move. That car ride. <laughs> I've been there. <laughs> that car ride. And I was like, ooh. But the whole time I was like, ooh, I'm feeling a little. But this, I felt, you know, here's the thing. I cracked off a couple ones <laughs> and it was <laughs> fine. But there's a certain <laughs> fart. Wait, there's a certain fart that you know, ooh, something's coming. Like a pre, like a like yeah. an earthquake, like a <laughs> yeah. Uh, imagine yeah. driving by and you see Eric. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got uh, it. I was, in the, <laughs> I was in the parking lot. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> in the parking lot. Like, okay, oh. so a mom with the kid in the yeah. fucking. Tr- She's all. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, but it's like I'm going like this, and I look over. <laughs> <laughs> how, how long ago was that? <laughs> the oh, the was kids like ago. I do that. It was um, a while ago. No, listen, dude, that's so, uh, that's horrible, dude. Yeah, it was horrible. That is just horrible. If I was 10 minutes from home, I was already late. It was mm. one of those things where it's like, what do I do? Where were you going? I was, I was, it was, it was you like a remember. dinner meeting. Was, was it a, was it a, di- <laughs> was it a diarrhea situation? Yeah, it was, 
was like, yeah, I, yeah, 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 of course it was. You know, sometimes when you have well, like certain kinds of farts, it leads to you know diarrhea is coming. No, yeah. because your body being like, we're trying to get this out, so it's like, oh my god, <laughs> oh my god, and it's, <laughs> and it's, and it's, and it's a, right. and it's a mess. Oh, yeah, it's, a mess. it's just a, it's mess. a mess. But but it was like it was a squeaker that I thought I stopped it. That's what I'm saying. So it was like yeah, I went, yeah, 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 ooh, yeah, 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 I thought yeah. I got it. Yeah, it was, like a, it was like a jizz, like, yeah, a was net, like, a, like a little rope came yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, I thought I got it. Ooh, I got it, yeah, I got yeah, it. And I was like, I didn't get it. You the, did bukkake on your fucking yes. butt, dude. The, the levees broke. Bukkake uh, on your cheeks. Make? Oh, he, he didn't want to talk about the last time he shit himself. Oh, 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 oh I forgot it because it was fucking no, I can't. I, I, was trying, I can't remember the last time I shit myself. I played Russian roulette. I have. I play Russian roulette. You ever fought? Fans. You ever in a fight? Never. Do fighters shit Never. themselves? No, nope, bodies not really. too locked up? No, uh, Yoel. There's been, there's been. You've never been punched in There's been like two examples. Been majority. No. Justin Kish and Yoel Romero. Yeah. There's been two. Well, they wow. shit themselves. But in they, general. They fought each other and bullshit. Oh, remember when Larry Holmes, after he fought Tyson, vomited? Ooh. Well, that's just extreme I've work. Thrown up he was just there. walking across the thing after the fight. Just, Amazing, you know, dude. Yeah. He probably shouldn't have drank water. Oh shit! Oh shit! Uh, Ooh, that's disgusting. That's that's turtle ooze because he's oh, built like a ninja turtle. Oh no! Oh, oh hey, man! The other person smells that. That's actually a good technique. Yep. <laughs> tap tap. You know uh -oh. how you, you know how they're real close to their yeah, face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, this kid's is worse because this is actual shit on the mat, right? I just shit myself. I just shit it. Yeah, look at that. Oh. That was a chick. She squeezed it out of her, but she didn't tap. Yeah. That's disgusting. Have you ever seen that one where they're in a hot tub? That movie's called The Eric Griffin. Everybody's in a hot tub. On, on a, uh, and then, and, here and, comes Eric Griffin on his way to dinner. <laughs> and then the girl, here comes the Griffin. What is it? Oh, this girl was in a hot tub, and then she like just poof, and then the diarrhea was like, Ugh, and everybody jumped out of the tub. No, hell no. <laughs> hell no. No, I haven't he seen that. He was there. Yeah. Um, By girl, you mean and you I, didn't, I didn't jump out right away. I was just like, Dude, I mean. I told this story on stage once a few weeks ago, but man, I went to New York once and I, I got there all early in the jet lag. I woke up early. I, you know, I woke up at like 6 a.m. I never wake up at 6 a.m. And I was like, I'm going to go fucking stroll the streets of New York. I'm going to fucking just be a New York guy. Right, mm -hmm. I take a few steps. I get a fucking. Uh, this is it. Oh, That's it. Fuck. Yeah. This look, is at it. Her, look at her face. <laughs> Sheer terror. Yeah. This is it. Ooh. Look Everyone's like, "What the stomach. fuck, Becky?" This is another one. The one I saw was like a, a black girl did it. Oh, this is this oh, might be it. She's like, "Oh no." She doesn't know. <laughs> tried farting in the tub. Like, she knows right now. She goes, "Oh shit, my stomach." <gasps> oh. Oh. Is that real? I don't like the way oh. she stood up. You know what? In her it fake way. She she's up. she's mortified with herself right now because in her mind she's been like, "Oh God, I'm going to be you know sh shitty Sharon for the rest of my <laughs> life." You got to own it. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. I would have just sat in it like, "Yeah, sorry." <laughs> so, you turn on the jet. You, right. you have a hot tub, Chris? Uh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, don't let Eric in. No, 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 no. Let me do it. Yeah, yeah. Eric's gonna do it and go. <laughs> I'm shitting in Chris's hot tub. <laughs> <laughs> what's this gentleman want? <clears throat> Eric, what's this? this? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Why is it brown? All right. All right, guys. Got a debate club for you. Movie star versus rock star. See by the mic behind me. I'm trying to do the rock star thing. That mind, I would go movie star all day. The shelf life of an artist is so short. I'm 33, might as well be 70 in this business. But uh, curious to hear what your thoughts are. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. Okay, first of all, being an actor for a long time is different from being a movie star. Mm. People are not movie stars for a long time. It's only a handful of people. Some people, yeah. Tom Cruise is a movie star for his entire career. Leonardo okay? DiCaprio. Yeah, yeah. Leonardo, Johnny you know, Depp. Yeah, but if you're talking about, so if you want to be one of those guys, then yeah, all right, but but I think I would rather be like a movie star than like a rock star who has to now do, you know, seven hundred shows a year. No, I would to be a rock star. There would be many things I would rather be than a rock star. Yeah. I do not want to be a rock star. Yeah, yeah, I would not like that at all. Yeah, you'd rather be a movie star. Yeah, yeah, 100%. but you're sort of you're not working. You're kind much. of a rock star. You're on the road. You know no, what I'm saying? the thing about the rock star thing that I don't like is I don't give a fuck about singing. <laughs> That's the thing I don't like. Well, you like. took singing lessons. Yeah, because I had to be well-versed in all of it. <laughs> yeah, he had a really, his childhood was like, you know, they were just like, all right, do re mi fa so la go. <laughs> That's <what> I, <laughs> so not my childhood. Bill came in and was like, do it. <laughs> him, him and Matt had to harmonize. <laughs> and they were crying. Yeah. <laughs> There's so 525,600 <laughs> minutes. 
and you to do it again. <laughs> My brother, what about love? <laughs> It's like that scene from uh, Step Brothers. Yeah. That's, I've never seen that. Oh, you movie. have. I know. Watch Step Brothers. I know. I know. Bum, I know. The scene in Step Brothers oh. where they're in the car yeah. singing. And she's like, got eyes <laughs> and the He's whole, like, and the whole family he's like you're not harmonize. even singing it right. $300 or less. You're not even doing it right. I'll take it from here. <laughs> uh, no, but, but it's like you don't sing, but it's equivalent to doing comedy and being like, Whatever that is. Yeah, but but uh, the being silly thing is that rock stars are too serious, dude. I, that's not fun yeah, to me. Fun though. It, that's, that's but not fun also, to me. but the rock star you're on oh, the road go, all go, the go, time. Go, uh, like that's oh, so cool. That that's that's bah, straight bah, up bah, corny as fuck. That's Ro- the shows. Rolling Stones are still out there. It's man. corny. Oh, it's they're corny. too old for that. Oh, yeah. Here's the other thing too. Because you don't like music. Because you're no, no, no. freaking oh, hard to be doing it. Let me tell you something. You got to be doing it. <laughs> I like jokes like that. You got to be doing it 50 years before it's not corny. Like ro- you're corny, bro. You've been doing, killing it for 10 years. You're corny. 50, 60 years really doing this shit, you're not corny anymore because then you're legends. I disagree. And that's the end of the conversation. No, next. no, I disagree. <laughs> I think that you're corny when you're like, if your song is corny and it, it has a shelf life. Like if you're these guys, I want to sex you up. Oh, you know see, what I mean? that's not corny. That's <laughs> yeah. not corny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ooh, no, that like, one, dude. Like if you yeah. have to be that guy. Yep, yep, yep. No, like, corny's like bare naked ladies. Like oh. if you're doing it now. Yep. What's that? That's what I'm saying. It's, it's been one day. Was that one? It's been, been one day. One week. I like to be. Turn my head to silence. Or, or, or you're like, what's the guy? Sugar something. Like he. Had oh, to, oh, 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 Sugar Ray. Oh. Sugar Ray. Sugar Ray. Right. Sugar Ray had to. Now like, he does fucking eat yeah, Now he's like, you know, because you, you can't do that anymore. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like look at the, every morning when I wake up. Is that him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That one. Every morning when I wake up and I'm fucking. Nobody knows the next part. Boyfriend's bad. Check it out, baby. Don't say a word, right? That's what it would do. Yeah, I don't think that's a gay version. It is for him. Smash Mouth. That guy's a disaster. He was oh, hammered now, that bro, one. Yeah, they showed him. So that part. Did you know his song? I'm gonna video th- where he just keeps saying and it don't stop coming and it don't stop coming and it don't stop in the edit and it's like fucking 10 minutes have you seen it it no, makes he, me laugh bro <laughs> he's, so he's not so doing it he shows up at this thing there's barely anybody I know, there I know he's I like know. nine beers deep I know so you're all we're all saying we'd rather be uh, <laughs> there's, there's no movie question. star because you don't have to travel all the there's time no on question. the road movie yeah, star movie and you can pick when you have to be oh dude but that's so funny it keeps cutting back to that and that's all it is for fucking however long it's like an hour they don't stop coming for 10 hours 10 hours and has 3 million Views. <laughs> it's so funny, oh because dude. you send that to your friends you send that yeah, to your yeah, friends yeah. and you go yeah, yeah. like shout out to the great late brody stevens oh. mm. he had this great video of him jump roping mm-hmm. for two minutes mm-hmm. and he, what you do you send it to people and you go what you have to wait for the end oh man and there's just no get through it it's just, it's just that's like, it's just him it's doing just, the whole thing. It's just him jump roping the whole time. And then he puts the jump rope down, and that's it. <laughs> and then great. everybody writes you back like this. The fuck f- you. Yeah. <laughs> Two minutes you wasted. You got <laughs> Oh, man. That was great stuff. That uh, guy, nobody was funny like that, dude. I know, dude. That guy didn't send it, but he said he's trying to be a rock star, so I asked him for his music. Do we want to hear Yeah, uh, I'd love it. We'll tell him if he should get into acting or okay stick with it. Is it okay to play? Uh, yeah, it's his, right, cool. so he'll get yeah, on. Yeah, if he signed off on it. Gifted Youngsters. R- written by the no gifted feelings. Youngsters. No feelings. Smoking. Okay. Oh, where is that? What, what city? Is that uh, Toronto? Seattle? Seattle. To basics, Toronto. I could not escape this journey, man. The greatest getting flagged for the late hit steps. I retrace this all the way back to May 15th, 1989. The Gloria and D. Why is it kick crap? I, I like that. Because it was when it was first. May 5th, 1989. One of us was doing the work. Remember that. Different jacket. Why the same style? Two jackets with the same jacket. Two different colors, same jacket. I got a green one, got a gray one. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Yeah, like I got some shit, but I don't. It's the same jacket. We adjusted the cue on the screen. It's not bad. It's not bad. I like it. Yeah. It's not bad. It's not bad. And he set up the whole video with like, it's like not only is the same jacket, but it's the same shot. One shot. Like, like go to go to that city now. Could you tell a difference that I changed my jacket? (laughs) (laughs) The only thing changed was the jacket. (laughs) 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 And now we now we show that version, you know. But we have an update from uh, 
Eric, the nose guy. He just sent in a video. Oh, shit. I actually haven't seen it yet. Oh, that's my guy. That's it. Yeah. Hell, oh, oh, hell yeah. He looks good. Shit, he's starting to look like oh, Brendan. word up. <laughs> Man, he looks good. No, he looks like Nick. <laughs> yeah. Hey, guys. It's Eric. I just want to give you an update after the nose surgery. It is all complete. I feel like I have fully recovered. Whoa. I am back at work full time. And I also just wanted to send my gratitude out again of how you guys have treated me in this studio. I really appreciate it, You're guys. Thick it boy, means honey. more to me than you'll ever know. Thank you for helping me through the rough time of my life. And gang, gang, buzz, buzz. Guy looks phenomenal. Yeah. yeah. I mean, look, Still look, breathes much, better than me. What's that? He breathes better than me, I guarantee it. Yeah. Even with you one nostril. Like, you, know, you know, it's like it's one of those, this is one of these life-changing moments, mm -hmm. and I hope his life from, it's all up from mm -hmm. here, bro. Yeah, man. Yeah, he looks, he, he mean, looks so much I mean, better. So much better. So much healthier. Eric won him $400 on Cats After Dark. Oh, oh yeah! Check out Cats yeah. After Dark on yeah. YouTube. Happened? No, we're we're, we're going to rebrand a new after show, I think. We, oh, we, we, oh, we, oh we right. Of course, check yeah. out yeah. Unlisted After Dark. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I love this guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he looks dope in that yeah, thick yeah, boy. Yeah. That's great. We got to get him in. He'll be an intern with George. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was just like a bunch of misfits here. You know yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Broke face guy, fucking broke yeah. face guy, former yeah. fat guy. Yeah. <laughs> that, dude, that nose when he first done that video, that juicy Ooh, nose, fresh sausage, off the bro. surgery. I thought it was a sausage. That thing was juicy. Yeah. All right, guys. Yeah, we did it. Ugh. Seattle, it's selling out. You better hurry up. Chrysalia.com, fucking Savannah. This comes out Thursday, right? Yes. Yeah, Savannah, yeah. Georgia, every Thursday. Raleigh, woo, fucking Boston. That second show, we fill it up. Dude, Calusa Casino, come check me out. I can't wait to be done with this Calusa. fucking date. Calusa. This guy says Calusa so Calusa. fucking Calusa. <laughs> Calusa Casino, I'm coming to you. Well, my dates, can I get my little dates can out? Can he Mr. do I, But like, I don't like how Fuck you... Fuck off. Calusa, Calusa. Oh, I don't like it. Calusa. 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 Oh, it's Calusa Casino. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll I'll be I'm <laughs> switching my jackets. Two shows, two different jackets. <laughs> two shows, two jackets. <laughs> Shout out to that dude. What's his name? Make sure you put him in the fucking... You know, Dude, the things. youngsters, gifted youngsters. Oh, gifted yeah. youngsters. Uh, I'll be wearing two different jackets on stage in Salt Lake City <laughs> this Thursday, time. Friday, Saturday. We got a fight companion Saturday at 11 a.m. Pacific time on Thick Boy YouTube. Next week, Calgary. Thursday, sold out. We had a show Friday at the rooftop downtown Calgary. Could be freezing. Then after that, I'm in San Antonio, Houston. Get your tickets, thickboy.com. Also, Thick Nectar. <clears throat> Stop calling it Nectar. Tiger thanks, Thick. Man. Thick Nectar. Dude, thanks, Tiger Stop Thick. Nectar. You can get it. Go to thickboy.com. Batch two gets nectar. the awards on the side. It's thick nectar, nectar, dude. Nectar, dude. I mean, dude nectar. Wait till you're done to do all the <gasps> shit. I'm sorry, I had to. You, you think I can control my body? Yeah, this guy shit himself. <laughs> he just <laughs> shit himself oh, on the way to on. dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Love you guys. Yeah. It's the king and the sting. Back up in this thing. I just got a call that said they want it at the wing. They got me working OT all night long. How many times I gotta make this song? Hey, hold on, what is this? Now y'all wanna switch? I'll just add a CB and Eric and they all adding Chris. How's that gonna fit? Wait, I get the gist. I just probably have to slow it down and hit it like this. It's the king, the wing, and the stink. Nah, oh. It's the wing and the king and the stink. Nah, hold on, hold on. Hold on, wait a minute, let me think. It's the king and the sting and the wing. Let's go. King and the sting and the wing. Got it full circle and put on the whole team. Legendary trio, Brennan, Chris, and Theo. What you mean? You know it's the king and the sting and the wing.